What's up guys? This is Derek House from DHFDNS.com and today I'm going to show you guys how to make my bodybuilding chicken parmesan. It's quick, simple, and more than calorie friendly. So let's get to it. The first thing you're gonna do is take out one and a half pounds or 24 ounces of chicken breast, trim the fat off of them, and then cut each piece in half this way. So for every chicken breast that you have, you should end up with two pieces that are about this big. After you slice your chicken breast, put it off to the side and then take out two bowls, one small one and one medium sized one. One thing I do wanna mention really quick, if you want to prep enough for the whole week, you can easily double or even triple this recipe. Now the first thing we're going to add into the small bowl is two extra large egg whites. And then one tablespoon of olive oil. Go ahead and lightly mix those together. The first thing you're going to add into the medium sized bowl is two thirds a cup or 60 grams of whole wheat breadcrumbs. Whether or not you wanna use seasoned ones is completely up to you. And then eight tablespoons or 40 grams of grated Parmesan cheese. Mix both of those together. Next, preheat your oven on 450, take out a baking sheet and then coat it with some nonstick cooking spray. Put your chicken breast onto your baking sheet. Take out a pastry brush and then brush each chicken breast with your wet mix. After you brush your chicken breast, dip it into your dry mix. If there's any dry mix left over, just evenly distribute it across the top of your chicken breast. Last, before the oven, coat the top of each chicken breast with some non-stick cooking spray. And then into the oven on 450 for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, take them out, flip them over, and then evenly distribute half a cup or 123 grams of pasta sauce across the tops of them. And then 3 fourths a cup or 84 grams of reduced fat mozzarella cheese. After that, put them back into the oven on 450 for around five to 10 minutes or until your cheese is melted. After 10 minutes for me, it does look done. So I'm just gonna take it out. And there is your bodybuilding chicken Parmesan. Three quick tips. One, you can use whatever type of pasta sauce you want. Today, I'm using a no salt added one. But for example, sometimes I like it spicy, so I'll use a spicy pasta sauce. Two, you can eat this with quinoa, rice, pasta, beans, Laffy Taffy, or whatever you prefer. And three, a silicone pastry brush is a great investment for your kitchen. This one only costs around $8 shipped, is easy to clean, dishwasher safe, and will last you forever. I do post a link to this one in the description below. As you guys saw, the chicken parmesan is done, so now I'm just gonna try a bite. So if Scarface was a bodybuilder that dealt chicken parmesan instead of cocaine, this would be the best seller. All of the flavors of a chicken parmesan are there. Absolutely delicious. As far as the calories go in the whole recipe, there's 1,515, 43 grams of fat, 55 grams of carbs, and 227 grams of protein. So if you divide this up into six servings like I do, in each serving there's gonna be around 252 calories, seven grams of fat, nine grams of carbs, and 38 grams of protein. So I have a question for you guys. Since this was one of my favorite meals growing up, what were some of your favorites? Let me know in the comments below. All right guys, I just wanna thank you for watching. If you like this recipe, please go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. It motivates me to keep making these. If you haven't already subscribed and you'd like to, you can do so by clicking right there on the screen coming up. By subscribing, you'll get an email every week telling you I upload a new video. Comments or suggestions go down below. I do try and respond to everybody. 
Thank you guys again for watching. I got some chicken parm to finish. Stay healthy.